is Crystal with Pineapple Papers, and I am back with another How to Kill a Kit for the month of February layout. And this one, I pulled in something that was not in my kit. So that huge floral there, um, I have been trying to kind of clean and organize not only my craft room, but really my entire house. So that floral was on a calendar and it was just 12 months of florals and it was from like, I don't know, two years ago and it's been sitting in my craft room because I knew I wanted to fussy cut these beautiful florals. And so one night I just took it to the couch and off we went. Um, so that is where that's from. So I am taking the Project Life cards that I had in my kit and I'm basically just looking at them for color and I am using them to back my photo. So originally I thought I wanted to use that gold pineapple um, and then have just the tops um, sticking out, but let's be honest, I... I really need to fussy cut those out and those need to go somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. So I have this strip of leaf paper left and I'm going to put that down one side and then I am going to make two, two main clusters, one where the floral is and then one up in the left hand corner and I have an acetate leaf, I have a die cut leaf, I have these uh, gold foil clear stickers, and I'm just going to kind of scatter them around. So this picture is actually of um, the pool at the resort we stayed at. And at the very top there's like a jump, and it's probably a 10 foot jump. Um, into the pool and it's super deep. It was, it was pretty fun. Um, so we did that and then there was this crazy fast slide that, um, we went on and when I landed, I totally bruised my foot cause that's how fast it was. Um, so that's just kind of the story I want to tell about the pool. And this is the family pool. So, um, we actually didn't spend a ton of time here. It was kind of cold and shady. Um, whereas one of the other adult pools had a little bit more sun. So that's, that tended to be where we stayed a little bit. So now I have truly committed to what I'm doing and I am gluing everything down. Um, these little acetate pieces, some of them had backings and some of them didn't. So that was me attempting to see if there was a backing on it that I needed to uh, remove. And of course that piece didn't have one. But um, I am just sprinkling that around and at this point I'm thinking, okay, I'm, I'm pretty much done, um, but it needs something. Um, and if you've watched me for any amount of time, you know that I'm really not the best with white space. So that being said, I reached for my shimmers and this is, hold on, going peach side. And so I'm just going to take it and normally I would have done the packaging technique all around, but I'm just taking my brush and just applying it straight to the cardstock. There definitely is a little bit of a different look to applying it with the paintbrush versus applying it with the packaging. And for me, I think it's because when I do the packaging technique, I usually add water to it because I don't want it so concentrated. So this gives you a little bit more of a concentrated look. And then I am just adding some splatters to that as well. And here's where I am going to get some adhesive down on a few things. And I do like to have some of my embellishments go off the page. I don't have any trouble trimming them off and, and just kind of letting it go type thing. So I have these amazing tropical florals from Spiegel Mom Scraps. They're little wood veneer um, flowers and they are very 
tropical because they're called tropical florals. That was really dumb of me. Um, so <laughs> I am going to just add a little bit of glue and attach them in three different spots. Two of them are down in the cut cluster and one is in the upper cluster. And I am going to add the word sun next to that paradise clip. And I don't know if somewhere I lost the H or it didn't come with an H. I'm not really sure. Um, so it's supposed to say sunshine, but I'm not going to be able to use that shine because it doesn't have an H. So um, if anybody can come up with a word that just uses S-I-N-E, please let me know and leave me a comment below. Now, I will tell you that um, I stopped the video because I think I'm done, and then I realize that I really want to add some sequins to this layout. So I have grabbed the peaches and cream from Spiegel Mom Scraps, and I put that in the center of the florals, the die cut florals, as well as a couple in the wood veneer florals. So I hope you enjoy that and remember to wear your crown. We'll see you next time. Bye.